How do you find a good athlete? Easy, you just try Conation. Our next story this evening is about picking winners and this question. What is it about an athlete beyond one's physical condition that separates winners from losers? How do you measure things like heart and drive and spirit and soul? ABC Steak Shap has found someone in Phoenix, Arizona, who thinks she knows the answer. When Dan Marley of the Phoenix Suns hurdles through the air and slam dunks, one fan may cheer a little louder than most. Her name is Kathy Colby, and she is cheering for Marley's jam and her own judgment. Two years ago, she advised the Suns to draft the little-known Marley. When we recommend Marley, we didn't just recommend Marley. We said, take him, take him, take him. She'd never seen Dan Marley play, had no idea if he was left-handed, right-handed, tall or short, or anything about him, but she evaluated his test and said, this guy has heart, and he'll be a great player if he has any skill at all. And uh, he's been exactly what she said he would be, uh, the toughest guy on the floor every night he goes out there. Anybody remember what word I found it under in the thesaurus? Kathy Colby, a consultant to the Suns, is the creator of the Colby Conative Index, a test that measures a person's conation. What is conation? It sounds familiar, but it isn't. It is defined in a book called The 1,000 Most Obscure Words in the English Language as the area of one's mentality that has to do with desire, volition, and striving. In other words, the will to win. You know, I was kind of nervous taking it because I didn't know if I was giving her the right answer or the wrong answer, but I think everything worked out. There are no right answers. Colby's test simply shows whether a person is primarily one of four types. A quick start, who is a risk taker. A fact finder, who plays the percentages. A follow through, who sticks to the game plan. Or an implementer, who is instinctive and physical. Dan is a very talented implementer. This means he's a natural athlete who is going to be banging under the boards. He's going to be a guy who's going to play right up against another player. He's going to play a very, very physical game. The whole key to team building is to find people with the right cognitive mix so that they, they create a synergy between them. What she brought to the table was two things that we could never do. We can't make an incision in the forehead and we can't make an incision over the heart to really see what's inside that person. Two years ago, the Suns were one of the worst teams in the NBA. Now, they are one of the best. Clearly, Kathy Colby has given them a hand. Dick Schaap, ABC News, Phoenix.